My name is Theo Forstaggy. I'm a neurosurgeon. I came as a volunteer to Sheba Hospital in Tel Aviv because of the attack on October 7th. A miracle is something which is unexpected. It's something you can't ask for. Sometimes it's also something you can't explain. And it's something which often evokes a sense of wonder. There are really three parts to it. One part is that you're saved. Something that maybe could have been very threatening or been very dangerous, you were spared. The second thing is that in a miracle, you realize that what's happened is unusual. Sometimes people call that revelation. And then there's a third part. When there's a miracle, usually there's a sense of obligation that occurs afterwards. And for many people, it's a sense of obligation to God, but it's also an obligation to those around you who may have participated and helped. And there's also a sense of obligation to society, that triad of salvation and then revelation and then obligation is a very strong part of what miracles are about. They're big miracles and they're small miracles. One of the big miracles is this hospital. The fact that you have a hospital here, the largest in the region, one of the 10 best hospitals in the world, that is available for people who are injured and hurt and sick, and does such an amazing and devoted job of caring for those people day in, day out, on a regular basis, and not only professionally, but also personally, taking care of families as much as it's taking care of the sick and of the wounded. That's a big miracle. And then you have any number of smaller miracles. The smaller miracles are the healing, people smiling at you when you don't expect them to, regaining function, regaining the use of limbs, those are, in a way, the smaller things, even though they're very, very big things. So we're surrounded by miracles here, and they occur day in and day out. It's one of the amazing things of working in a hospital and one of the great things about working in this hospital.